But Dr. Manyasa, why is it important that the transition is done at grade six and not seven or even eight? Th that is a discussion that was had uh, quite a bit during the development of this curriculum. And following research that showed a lot of children who drop out of school, drop out of school at age 12, 13. A decision was made to create this transition at that age to try and prevent the sentiments, some of them originating from cultures where boys go into initiation at that age and they feel they're too big for school now, to have a reason to see that they have gone into a new level and to continue to stay in school. So the thought of, because we we'll still have implemented CBC yeah. in 844 system, so that the children still learn for eight years in primary and go to secondary school. Those proposals were put on the table, yeah. they were looked at, and there was the idea that let us have children transition at age 12 okay. to the next, to junior secondary. It is not a proposal that I myself quickly bought initially because I thought we did not need to make second years longer because overall that increases the cost yeah. of education. But I was persuaded mm. that, that the risk of children dropping out at that age was much higher. And if we are interested in following the constitutional requirement of Kenya that basic education is a right, yeah. and that includes secondary, then we needed to find a way to keep children in school. All right. So there are challenges, and I don't want to say there are no challenges bedeviling it, the CBC implementation. There are challenges. And I wish that we could focus on those and focus on what are the solutions? Because yeah. the idea of let us stop, yeah. we have said since we started implementing, we haven't stopped. Mm -hmm. It is taking away our energies yeah. that we should be focusing on how do we address the challenges. Okay.